Claire, it's Haley. Just a reminder that uh, when you get in, that the Ross deposit has to be in the escrow account by 10. And, and another thing, the house inspection report has to be picked up today as well. Um, make sure the buyer signs off on it and don't forget the issue about the roof because you may have to get an estimate on it ASAP. Any other problems, you know, you, you can reach me on my cell. So um, I'll call you from the room. Okay. Thanks a bunch. What? Are you sure this is a good idea? Haven't we already had this conversation? I don't remember much of a conversation. Okay. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> well, this trip in your relic of a motorhome was, I believe, your idea. Oh, it's a relic. Yeah. All right. You know, I seem to remember uh, you and I had a lot of good times in this relic before the kids were born. What's a relic? Ask your mother. Hey, Rudy, do you remember that guy back in the joint with a funny way of talking? What was his name? The bald guy there, um... The bald guy. Yeah. That's good, Cliff. And there's a down about a thousand guys. You know, the one that owed you money. Man, what was his name? They found him, cut belly to throat, um... Shut up and drive. You know, when I was a little kid, my dad used to take me fishing all the time. We had a lot of fun together. He knew all the best places to go, trout fishing. We'd get up real early in the morning, and he'd always put on his aftershave. One time I asked him, how come, Dad, you're always putting on the aftershave when we go fishing? He said, all oh, the fish like it. <laughs> Guess he had to be there. Well, this is the place. here. Right on time, Clivy. Uh, yeah. Rudy, this is Kenny, the guy I told you about. He's a plane ride. Kenny, this is Rudy. You sure this thing can make it to Canada in one piece? <laughs> what are you, an aviation expert, pal? I'm an expert on staying alive, pal. Well, all I need is my front end. Your hardware. Okay. Cliff, don't play with that. There's a little airstrip about a half a mile south of Wintergreen Quarry, closed for the summer. You can't miss it, unless you're on drugs. 
I'm going to be there at 1500, engine idling. That's 3 o'clock to you guys. All you got to do is take the 100 north, find the quarry road, and that goes to the airstrip. OK. I'm going to give you 15 minutes grace. You're not there at 315. I'm out of there. Got it, pal? Yeah, I got it, pal. Good doing business with you. Same, same. Let's get out of here, Cliff. You make sure you're there, huh? Haley Griffin, Three Star Realty. Uh, I'm sorry, you know what? You're gonna have to call the office, ask for Claire Daniels. Uh, she'll arrange to show it to you. Daddy, I'm hungry. That's all right, sweetheart. Mommy will make you something when she gets off the phone. Yes. Yes, I know that it's my listing, but I'm sure Claire will be happy to show it to you, all right? I'm just leaving for a um, vacation. <laughs> Thanks. Bye-bye. I thought you said that you were going to leave work and uh, that thing behind. Honey, I haven't had a call on the Finley house in six months. It's off. OK, look. Promise? I promise. This must be the place. Tell me something. How'd you get to be so damn smart? You keep the change now, beautiful. Thanks, Bob. Have a nice day. town should get one of those huge spotlights only in the shape of a big donut and then we could just shine it in the sky when somebody got in trouble you know like like Batman well, donuts are a sheriff's best friend roast beef rare two pickles when did I get so lucky the day you married me well, you might have a point there yeah. Ooh, you need a trim I guess so Maybe I'll drop by Jimmy's this morning. Things are pretty quiet. Hey. Hi. Coffee? Oh, please. Look up in the sky. It's the Donut Man. <laughs> Look, I'll see you at home around 7, OK? Love you. Bye, honey. How are you today? Singing a song, cause I love you. Singing a song, singing a song. <laughs> That's good. I'm singing a song, don't make it wrong. Don't make it wrong. <laughs> don't be so glum, Shane. We're gonna really have a good time when we get there. I'd have a better time if I was at home with my friends. <sighs> yeah, I go to that stupid Acne Enigma concert. Acid Enigma? Whatever. 
Mom! Jane, leave your sister alone. Come on. It's gonna be a chance for us to spend some quality time together. Yeah, quality time in the middle of nowhere. Small town banks. Never any problem. It's a beautiful thing. Hey, Cliff. Keep the engine running. Think you can do that? Nobody moves, nobody gets hurt, okay? Okay, fill this up. Come on, let's go, let's go. That's good. Keep it quiet over there. Your hands where I can see them. Is there uh, something wrong, officer? No parking zone. What? No parking here. Right. Right. Sorry. Don't move. Fill it up, same like her. Hold on. Someone call an ambulance! Honey, do you think you should maybe just, you know, take a look at the map? Just, just to be sure. I did that. Did that at home. Everything's right up here. Interstate 7, cut off at Highway 4. East on 100, we look for the sign. And voila, we're there. Ah. Uh, no, it's actually the voila that I'm worried about. It's <laughs> the local thing. Yeah, right, sure. Here, here. Shut up. Get over here. Stay there. Moron. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hey, Dad, are we stopping to eat? Sorry. 
I believe the term you used was tip-top condition. This is Susan Wheaton reporting live from the town of Berkshire, where moments ago two gunmen robbed this bank here in Berkshire, and in a wild shootout, two people were killed. The information we've been able to gather so far is that a single masked man entered the bank and fatally wounded a guard inside the bank, while many customers watched in horror. And it doesn't end there. During the shootout on the street, We're the sure wife Hunt. of Berkshire Police Chief Bingham Hunt was killed as the man and his accomplice sped away. She was bringing me my walkie. I just don't understand, you know, she's never hurt a soul in her life. I'm so sorry. I should have seen it coming. The one in the car. I should have seen it coming. Don't even begin to blame yourself. You don't understand. I hit the driver, and he lost control. If only I just held my fire. You were doing your job, Megan. If I was doing my job, my wife would still be alive. We can handle it from here with the state police. Why don't you go home? You don't need to be here. I gotta get our guys moving, okay? You're gonna be all right. I need a doctor, Rudy. I'm hurting real bad. I swear to God, I'm dying, man. You're not dying. Not yet. <laughs> units, all units. This is an APB in a dark blue Ford Crown Victoria proceeding west on Highway 7. Suspects wanted in connection with the 211 in Berkshire. Considered armed and dangerous. Proceed with extreme caution. Step out of the car, please. Let me see your hands. We're looking for two men, last seen in an 89 blue Crown Victoria sedan. Lieutenant. The state chopper, when can we get it out here? That's a problem there. That's not available. They said maybe. That's unacceptable. Give me an ETA. Sheriff, that's state police jurisdiction. They're outside of Berkshire. Tracy is my wife. That makes it my jurisdiction. Anyone have a problem with that? No, sir. Good. 
The driver was white, six feet tall, medium build, uh, short hair. We believe the second man was also white, six feet tall and about 200 pounds. Now, best guess, they're heading north towards the Canadian border. Uh, Fugit has been on the run for the last 30 minutes, which gives us a minimum checkpoint radius of 80 miles. Alert the Canadian authorities. Checkpoints. I-100, I-108 are being set up as we speak. The mobile unit should be at I-100 by now. Shane? Shane? It's raining outside. I want you to take an umbrella out to your dad before he has a fit. And I'd also like you to give him this, too, in case he needs to call road service. Where's Tiffany? Oh, she's outside. Go! Pretty good. Nice umbrella. Put a little duct tape on that hose and uh, you're good as new. Here, Mom gave this to me to give to you for roadside service in case you need to call them. It's supposed to be funny. I don't need no roadside service. Well, you're gonna need is some tape right there. Yeah. That's all I need. Sure, Dad. Fix the whole thing right with, with tape. Stupid piece of junk. This piece of junk is gonna be yours someday. Oh, great. Cop car coming. Whoever said the cop's not around when you need one? Except I don't need one. We're gonna be okay. Just flagging by. Nice RV. Have it a ride. Not much to see. I want those men, Dana. Sheriff Hunt, the fugitive's car has been located. What? Two dead inside. One of the deceased was wearing one of your uniforms. This 
Listen, I don't know what this guy wants, but uh, I bet the state police are out there looking all over for him. They're bound to catch up with us sooner or later. You just gotta stay calm right now. Stay calm? The man has a gun pointed on our children, Jed, in case that you haven't noticed. Hey, punk, come here. Stay here, okay? What is with this hair, huh? What, are you trying to be cool? I'm not trying to be anything. Ooh, 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 ooh. You know what? We never should have taken this trip. Don't do this to me, okay? This is hard enough as it is. Just leave me alone. I'll figure something out. All right, that's enough. Let's go. You're just gonna have to trust me, okay? I said that's enough. Let's get out of here. Come on. My dad will kill you. Don't bet on it, kid. Chris on the scene? Of course, sir. Didn't touch anything? No, sir. Medical examiner, CSU? On the way, sir. Take care of this, Dana. All right, that's triangulation over here, there. I recognize the guy in the front seat from the bank. Jed. Jed Griffin. Jed Griffin. All right. I gotta get it here. It's on the road to Winter Green Quarry. I can't help you. I'm no good with maps. Never have been. He's right. We were lost earlier. Well, isn't this nice?
Where are you headed, ma'am? Ah, oh, just heading home. This has got something to do with that robbery, right? Anything I gotta worry about? No, ma'am, you should be fine. As long as you don't stop for anyone, and no hitchhikers, okay? <laughs> never have, never will. Heaven help the sorry ass fool who tries to mess with me. Now listen up, everybody. No funny business, okay? We are just one big happy family, right? We get through this. I might just let all of you go. That's the upside. And you don't want to ask me about the downside. Get over. Oh. oh, I almost forgot. Here's a bonus. You got the power of life and death in your hands. Yes. Let's go. Hold on. I think I'm afraid of you. Probably not. I can't help it. You were born stupid. Now get in there. Get in. Be careful, Jed. That's good advice, Jed. Don't do nothing stupid. Lost Oaks. Going on a ski trip. Shut your engine off, please, sir. What's the trouble? Just routine. Nothing to worry about, sir. What's the matter, sweetheart? Uh, she, she hasn't been feeling well. I lost Rufus. That's too bad. That's Rufus. It's tough when you lose your best teddy bear, right? Well, I'm sure you'll find him. Everything okay, folks? I know we've been uh, we've been on the road for a couple days. I guess we're all just kind of tired. Just the three of you traveling today? Yeah, yeah, just the three of us. Clear. I've located Levy's patrol car, seven miles southeast of your location. I will mark a 48. The car is abandoned. No signs of suspect. He has been picked up by an accomplice. I'm doing a foot search of the area. 
Proceed here ASAP. 10-4, I'm on my way. Out. For you. Don't you want to keep the picture of Rufus? Maybe you can find him. Well, I'll do my best, okay? Thanks, folks. Have a nice day. Sorry for the trouble. Okay. Well done. Everybody gets to live a while longer. I see this road. There's an exit about 10 miles up or something. I thought we had a deal. We had nothing. Drive. This is videotape from Brian's patrol car. Take it back to the state unit, see what they can come up with. I'm going after him. More on the late breaking story from Berkshire from news reporter Wes Erickson at the scene in Berkshire. Thanks, Tom. Police have now confirmed the deadly robbery that claimed the lives of two people this morning in the otherwise sleepy community of Berkshire is the work of two men. Police have advised citizens to be on the lookout for either man. Last seen in an older model dark sedan. Extreme caution in sight. Thank you, Wes. And now, on to news from the legend. I'll bet she does a feisty horizontal, huh, Jed? Why don't you go to hell? That pal has never been in doubt. For what I've done, or for what I might do. Hey! What the hell you doing? You hear me tell you to stop? You think you're a pretty big man with that gun, don't you? Oh, I know I am. Now, why don't you drive before I decide to use it? your hands off my wife. Oh, is that what this is about? Huh? Hey, Haley, I think I made Jed jealous. Maybe she'd like to try a real man. I don't think so. The entertainment portion of this trip is over. I'll drive her, I'll finish her right here. You ain't gonna shoot anybody. You need all of us alive. Don't be so sure, Dad. Maybe it's just you I don't need. So what's it gonna be? Jed, don't do anything. It's an alien, Jed. Daddy! How long before I can see this? Well, this looks ugly. I didn't ask you that. How long? Two hours. Maybe one if we're lucky. Hey, 
hey, look, I'm ready to make a deal. There's no downside in it for you. The hell you know about downside? Huh? Downside? You and your middle class life and your middle class family? Downside's my middle name. That's about to change as of today. So, Jed, don't beg. It's a sign of weakness. Nobody knows where you are. Nobody knows where you're headed. I'm not gonna give you any trouble, believe me. No, I don't believe you will. No deals. Drive. Forgot about this one. Meets the new old man. officer in a stolen Berkshire police cruiser belonging to slain officer Brian Levy. I'm sorry. I need a ride. I, I need your. Hey, listen, somebody kidnapped my family. Lady, I, I'm not gonna hurt you. Don't run away.
got a first aid kit, punk? Bring it to dad. Come on, kid. You're not my father. Go get it, punk. him alone. Maybe you like to try. Hmm? No guts. Just like your old man. Oh. <laughs> Friends over. Time to move on. I don't care. I need that chopper. Look, we've got a 6 AD fugitive from our jurisdiction. I don't give a damn. Get one from another county. That was, um, quite a ferocious display uh, back there. Hmm? I like that. Mm -hmm. Makes you think I won't kill you like your old man. Because you still need us to get past the roadblocks, that's why. I don't think so. I know so. You mess with my children again. I'm telling you right now, I'll kill you. I believe you would. Good. But that's not going to happen. Status on the video. We're gonna need more time. At CSU's got a couple of prints off it, and the feds are trying to find a match. And that driver you ID? One Clifford Lee Sims. He did some time in Angola State for armed robbery. Paroled two months ago. So much for the parole system. Any known associates? Yeah, yeah, somebody from the Florida system. An ex-cellmate named uh, Kenneth Denton. Find out more about him. Yeah. The chopper. Still tied up. You take this message to those state boys. We have an armed and dangerous fugitive on the loose. I want that helicopter now. Flowers. The tape's done. Well, the tape was in pretty bad shape. It was torn and covered in dirt. And those extended tapes are pretty fragile and 
and thin to begin with. Anyways, I salvaged as much as I could. Uh, a piece here, uh, a piece there. I lost a piece here. More damage, it's not a pretty sight. That's it. Okay, uh, rewind it. Okay, stop, play it from here. Stop it. Can you make that face clear? If I scan a piece here and there and cut and paste using my software and get rid of the digital noise and- We don't want to know how. Just fix it. Yes, sir. Doing. She had a bit of a rough time. She's okay now. What do you got? Here is the idea on the truck. What you got? Looks like a license plate number. Run it through the DMV, okay? Mrs. Higgins. Mm -hmm. Hi. How are you doing? Uh, look, we're going to take you down to the station, okay? Show you a few pictures. Maybe you can ID the guy who stopped you. Never forget a face. That's good. Dispatch. We have a suspect possibly headed down Highway 17 in a 78 GMC blue pickup. License plate number. Charlie David 6R75. Thanks for stopping. Hold it. Don't move. Hey, wait a second. Hey! You're making a big mistake. I'm not the guy you're looking for. 
I think you are. That uniform belongs to one of my men. Let me give myself up. You killed my wife. You'll pay. This is Sheriff Hunt to all units. Code 30. Have located bank robbery suspect. Suspect is wearing stolen Berkshire police uniform. Upon contact, suspect fled into woods. Have located older model blue GMC pickup truck. Highway 17, just west of marker 29. Requesting immediate backup. Suspect on foot. And bring in the K-9 unit. You're damn lucky you made it this far on the old one. You folks heard about the robbery over in Berkshire? The suspects, they get a description? Haven't heard. Only that one's impersonating a cop. That's enough. How far are you planning on going on eight bucks of gas? As far as we need to. for hunting season, isn't it, Bingham? He's on my turf now. He's running. An innocent man doesn't run from the law. So what are you, judge, jury, and executioner now? Maybe I am. Sir, we're ready. Bingham, if you do this, you're forgetting everything you ever taught me. Look, if you can't deal with it, fine. Just stay the hell out of my way. I can't get my ducks crossed there. We'll have to go around. Looks like he's headed to the I-7. How far? I don't know. Mile around, too. Find a way across and keep driving him. I'm going to head northwest. Yes, sir. Fine. Come on. Come on, boy.
units. I'm heading north to Highway 100 doing a perimeter search. Hey, no, still trying to contact Over. Officer Flowers, got something for you. Sheriff Hunt? Go for Hunt. I think I've got something here. Go. Quickly, Sims Powell, County Deputy, got his rap sheet. This boy's been busy. Two drug related charges in the last year. What charges? Smuggling. How? And he's a pilot. I want a complete list of every possible airstrip in the three county area, or anywhere else a small plane could be put down. I'm on it. Sheriff? Bingham, listen to me. Don't do this. Bingham. citizens for any information on the armed gunman who robbed a Berkshire bank this morning to call state police. Where do you keep your maps? Uh, over here. Hey, listen, just take whatever you need, but don't hurt me, okay? What are you talking about? I'm not gonna hurt anybody. Listen, my name is Jed Griffin. I want you to pick up the phone and call the cops and tell them I'm not the one they're looking for. The guy that robbed the bank, he's got my whole family hostage. He's on Highway 100, in the motorhome. They're heading north toward the quarry. You got that? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Is that your dirt bike? Yeah. I'm taking it. <sighs> Not even paid for yet. Hello, police. I'd like to report a stolen motorbike. We just ran his image through the FBI files and got a match. Here's the enhanced photo from Lee and the one from the feds. Oh, good work. Name's Rudy Wicker. Nine arrests, two convictions for armed robbery, parole violation, and two outstanding bench warrants. Hello? Mrs. Higgins, does this look like the guy who hijacked your truck? No. No. Never saw him before in my life. 
Had a 9-11 from a service station attendant up on 100 North. Suspect stole a dirt bike. A dirt bike? From where? Stole for service station, three miles past the turnoff. Yeah, I know where that is. Unit 14, come in. This is Unit 14, over. There's no such plate in the registry. Did you check surrounding states, like New York, New Hampshire, Connecticut, Massachusetts? Not yet. Well, then do it. Over. Yeah, it's a bad looking, huh? I could easily be a husband. What do you think? Not likely. Yeah, what the hell do you know? Huh? You think it's been easy for me? Killing's been easy for you, hasn't it? I've had some tough choices to make. Huh? You know what? It's, it's not too late. To do the decent thing. Let us go. Please. Please. It's a little too late for decency. Don't you think? I'm begging you. Shut up. I turn here. Turn here. Okay. That's it. Nice and easy. I've seen him. When? About an hour ago. Came in here with his wife and kids and got some gas. You sure this was him? That's it? There wasn't anything unusual about this guy? <sighs> no. This is Sheriff Hunt to K9. K9, come in. Abandoned search. Request you join me here at an old logging road, south of 17, near the 20 mile mark. It's over. 79 Motorhome. You see this guy? Yeah, that's him. 
He's the guy who stole my bike. <laughs> right after the RV left, he comes running in, screaming about his wife and kids. <laughs> and you're sure this is the man you saw in the RV? Yeah, yeah. The other guy was crazy like a loon. Screaming about his family, ripping up my maps. They cost money, you know. What map? This one. Take a look. Is that another one of these? possible hostage situation, requesting immediate backup, heading up into the mountains to Wintergreen Quarry. <laughs> You're gonna find my bike, right? Dispatch, can you patch me into Sheriff Hunt? Roger. Sheriff Hunt, Berkshire Dispatch. Sheriff Hunt, this is Berkshire Dispatch. Sorry, there's no response from the Sheriff. Keep trying, it's urgent. Roger on that. Okay, tour's over, everybody out, let's go. Out. Right on schedule. Just like I said I'd be. So where's Cliff? He's dead. And so are some others. A few things went wrong. You didn't say nothing about anybody getting killed. I don't think I want to get involved in this. Oh, you're already involved in it, pal. And you're flying me out of here. Just like our deal, remember? Yeah, I don't know. to me. Okay, you're still a boy. Listen to me for once in your life. Take her out of here.
Hey, where's everybody? Huh? Come on, I ain't gonna hurt nobody. Clever little bastard, aren't you, huh? Huh? Not clever enough. And he still got you, don't I? Yeah, you are! <laughs> You're gonna get me out of here. Like hell I will. Oh, yeah. Well, here's the deal. If you refuse, I go back and I find your mother and your sister. That's the downside. You cooperate. And I just take you with me. And that's the upside. Now what's it gonna be? I'll go. I thought you'd see it my way. Jeff? 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 Daddy! Oh my God. You're okay. Dispatch, code three, all units. On my way to Wintergreen Quarry. Can you get me a location on Sheriff Bingham? I repeat, code three, all units. for your dad, huh, monkey?
There's no brakes, Dad. What should I do? <laughs> See, come back here to me. I don't know if I should. Dad, we'll go over the edge. Do exactly like I tell you. Come back here, straight to me. Shane, come on. It's all right, Shane. Come on, son. That's good. Come on. That's it. Get the hell out of here. What about you, Dad? If I go out, it'll go over. No. I'll be right behind you. back in here. You're a tough man to discourage, you know that? So my wife tells me. Well, I'll try and do a better job this time. See that bag? To your left. No, your other left. That's it. Throw it here. Well, <laughs> there's an upside and a downside to that. The bag. The upside is you'll get your money. Yeah, and I'm holding the downside. Yours. I don't think so. The bag! Now! There's your downside. Hold it! I'm not the one you're looking for. We had this conversation. I know who you are, Wicker. Begum, that's... 
that isn't Wicker. His name is Jed Griffin. Dana, I told you to stay out of my way. You're making a big mistake, Bingham. The man who killed Tracy took this man's family hostage. That's his son over there. Bingham, put the gun down. Lower your gun. taught me to be a good cop. Somebody here wants to see you. I think his name is Rufus. I knew you'd find him. Thanks. 